Hey there, it's Daniel from thegoodax.com where you can get free Google Docs templates and guides. This time we are going to get a custom Google Docs template and then edit it ourselves. Today we are going to get and then edit a custom Google Docs template, meaning a template from any other source except those common ones on Google Docs and except making one on your own. This may seem unnecessary, but let's begin from signing into Google account. Simply go to google.com and when you're on Google's homepage, go to the top right corner of the screen and check whether you are signed in or not. If you are signed in, you will see your profile picture or an icon with a person if you don't have it. If you are not signed in, you will have such a button suggesting to sign in, so we press it. And here we enter either our email address or a phone number linked to the account. I'll go with email, which is the goodocs at gmail.com. Then I press next down here. And on the next page, I'm entering my password. And so are you. And then pressing Next over here. Now I'm redirected back to the Google homepage. But now I am signed in to my Google account. That you can always check by looking at the top right corner here. And if you see either your profile picture or an icon with a person, means you are signed in. Now from here, we go to the website with Google Docs templates or searching it in Google from right here. The Google Docs free templates and enter. Now let's scroll down and skip the advertisements. And here's the website, the Google that we press on. And we got to its home page. I'm not going to go really far here. We are going to use quite a common and popular one, the vintage newspaper. But keep in mind that the range of templates here is huge. And you can find here hundreds of newspapers and other Google Docs templates. Now let's get it. Click on the image or its headline. On this next page on the left, you can scroll down and preview the template. And get it if you like it. For that, go up and next to the image locate such a window. And press the Edit Template button. Here, as you can see, it says that it will be opened in Google Docs and you want to select the size where the US letter is 8.5 by 11 inches and the common A4 is 8.3 by 11.7 inches. I select A4. On the next page, we wait till the download starts, which will be done automatically. And on the next window, Google Docs will ask you if you want to copy the template to your Google Drive. So yes, to use it, press make a copy. Wait a bit. And it will open in front of you as a common Google document. But now it is located on your Google Drive. You can edit it and all changes will be automatically saved on your drive. Now let's do something with it. I suppose the first thing we can do is to change the name of the newspaper. Mine will be named The Daily Bugle News. And now it doesn't actually look good, taking too much space. And there's one word per line. But we can just decrease font size to make it fit in better. Let's highlight the text. Go to the top toolbar to the font size 
and click in minus button a few times until it fits. And here it is, perfect. Then we can modify the first headline. Let it be tomorrow rocket launch. Way better for my imaginary rocket launch. Then I can edit the first paragraph of the article. For that, I will highlight the current text and delete it. And then, hold on, I have it. On Wednesday 13, 1977, the local businessman Tom McGuire is launching the first commercial rocket. And for the picture, I wanted to correspond to the topic, and I have one. I'm going to delete the current one and upload a more appropriate one from my computer. Though it didn't fit in perfectly, so I want to adjust the bottom line and move it higher, like a glove now. So I'm finishing on this. But you got to know that the possibilities to create and edit the template are limitless. From the font style and size and colors with images to a total remake to make it look just the way you want. All this can become your completely new work because it's easier to get a free template and paste your data into it than designing it all on your own from its scratch. Fortunately, there are lots of absolutely free templates on the goodags.com for you. Hundreds more guides and a lot of free Google Docs templates on the goodags.com following the link below the video. Like to help share our videos to more people and subscribe to see more guides. I hope we helped you. Thank you for watching.